I started in journalism in 1972 and I think my first involvement with uh, covering a soccer game was 1973. In the early 1980s I started covering the, um, the National Soccer League and they were great days, it was certainly a lot different to what they are now. Uh, those days you were allowed to go into the dressing rooms and actually talk to the players after the game. Yes, yeah, def definitely different times. The people you met were fantastic, real down to earth people, so passionate, so dedicated about the game and, the, and that, that was the really good part of covering football those days. 1973, sitting in the lounge room watching the uh, 1974 soccer who's beat South Korea and the late Jimmy Mackay scoring that thunderous goal that got us into the World Cup for the first time. I've never jumped so far off, off the lounge as I did or cheered so loudly and um, yeah, that was a fantastic moment and uh, as a journalist, 32 years later, watching John Aloisi score that penalty at, at ANZ Stadium and got us through to the World Cup. Here's Aloisi for a place in the World Cup. He scores! Australia have got it! They're probably the highlights for me in actually covering that World Cup and covering the 2014 World Cup in, in Brazil. I think it's wonderful that a club like the Wanderers are acknowledging the past history of our, of our game and I think every A-League club should, should get involved. Uh, yeah, in terms of Western Sydney, it's a region that's full of tradition and passion and dedication. Yeah, in terms of football, uh, a lot of great players and coaches and administrators have, have come from Western Sydney and it's, uh, it's vitally important we don't lose sight of the fact that you know, we have history there and it should be acknowledged. The future of football in this country, it's such a tough question. Look, but no doubt we're going through tough times at the moment. I've got a lot of faith in the ability of the game to really move forward and I would love to see everyone from grassroots up to the administrators get together and make it the best game, the best sport in this country where it deserves to be.